simulations gain more and more significance and, at the same time, more and more data becomes available. The Cluster of Excellence Data Integrated Simulation Science at the University Stuttgart combines both of these areas and has defined three visions. Next Generation Virtual Materials Design the Digital Human Model and Engineered Geosystems. Poros media are everywhere. To define a sponge as porous seems to be quite obvious. But also asphalt concrete, bones, soil or fractured rocks are porous. In addition to Zymtech, the associated SFB 1317 is dealing with these topics. Here we are especially interested in understanding the effective hydromechanical properties of porous materials in order to develop mathematical models which can be used in simulations and for technical applications. So to go in this direction, we're going to need some high-speed cameras. At the Porous Media Lab, we are aiming to make porous media transparent by using high-resolution X-ray computer tomography. Based on CT scans, the pore space could be visualized, characterized, and segmented for subsequent direct numerical simulations. Pore morphology is a fingerprint of the concrete asphalt sample. So can we define the porosity and grain size distribution from the images? All these quantities are needed for further direct numerical simulations. Within SimTech, numerical tools are developed for such data-integrated simulation techniques. In the clean room, we prepared a wafer. And with this wafer, we are now able to create a light transparent micro model. And with this micro model, we can now investigate multi phase flow. Multi phase flow properties combined with a morphological imaging of the phase distribution have been investigated to understand the capillary pressure saturation relations. Image-based data, as the one obtained from microfluidics, allow for an insight into porous media combined with an advanced experimental characterization. Mm -hmm. 